There we go. Yo, what up? Okay. The plan as of right now is... I want to get two things done during this here... During this here stream. Well, I mean, no, not two things done during the stream. I want to get two things done in the main game before we go back to the DLCs and have some fun over there. First thing I want to do is I want to hit up Shaded Castle over here for Millie's quest. I want to get her that Valkyrie arm, Valkyrie. And number two, I want to go back to, whoops. How do I bring up the... I want to head back down here, and I want to... Where the hell was it? I forget where it was, but I want to go down here and fight the Baleful Shadow. I think it was, like, around here somewhere. I think. Can't really remember. I don't think I can go from here. I'm just doing this now so I don't... <laughs> so I can remember later. Oh yeah, no torrent. You can't go past here, right? There's just a straight drop in the death. Yeah, just a waterfall. Can't do that. Okay, so we gotta go back up here and do that later. But yeah, first. Millie arm. Let's get that Millie arm. So she can Millie rock. Or whatever it is she does with her arm. Oh, wait, I got a. What am I doing? I got a gray side way the hell over here. I have to make that journey. Just got to... Oh, I almost turned around. Into death. Oh, damn. I was about to toss a rock down there. giants out here, right? Yeah, there were. Nah. Next time. Alright, I want to be more independent during this run-through. During this session. During this little sesh. Because I don't know where I'm at skill-wise right now. And, huh? Oh. Because I easily took down Morgoth. Morgoth. I said Morgoth. Morgoth. But, I feel like I could have done it by myself. Well, I mean, no. I could have done it by myself. How did we get in here again? But I wanted to fight with Melina, because, I mean, it's Melina. You gotta have the help of the wife. Ow. Ow. Ow! I'm getting jumped. Oh, you're dead. Oh, that's right, I rolled in the poison. Uh, did we jump up here? Yeah, we did. 
Excuse you. Night of Flames. That's right. How's it going, Archon? We're going all around the spectrum here. First, we're the Scarlet Rock Gladiator. Then we're just the big heavy, the big heavy boy with the big heavy hammer. Yes, now you see me. And now we're a Flame Knight. Just like you, as a matter of fact. Use the flames. Except you're just very bad at it. So tricky. How you doing, Archon, by the way? You getting in, uh... I'm assuming you're out here playing more DLCables? There's another one here, right? Yeah, there's that guy. good. Literally just finished assembling the gear for my new build. Alright, what are we rocking with? So if I recall correctly, there's supposed to be a clean rot knight somewhere in the top right hand corner of the thing and that's where Millie's arm is and the killer ash of war flame skewer I got yesterday I got some cool weapons that literally flame knights use in the DLC totally upgrade the z-way hander put that flame skewer on there it's insane oh. All that for a glass shard? You're joshing with me. I actually think you can put it put it on any weapon. Uh Did I get the flame skewer when I Alright, hold on, let me check. Let me see if I got I just have it on a big sword. People seem to like their big swords in this game. Especially for PvP, they like the stab to catch back rolls and stuff like that. From what from what I've seen in PvP videos, they like those long stab motions to catch rolls. Seems pretty useful, because, I mean, I panic back roll all the time. <laughs> and I get caught on the regular. I don't know why I don't roll to the side more. Oh yeah, that's right. I was checking for Magma Shot, Gale Mill Fury. Uh, where'd you pick it up at? I'm assuming you got it in the DLC, because for some reason I thought you could get it when you fought that dude in the in Bellarat, but. Obviously not. Not seeing nothing here. Wait, what? Wait, am I using Flaming Strike? I think I'm using Flaming Strike. Hold on. Yeah, I'm using Flaming Strike, okay. Looks like you put it in your chest, that's odd. I thought you got it. Oh, well. <laughs> okay. Is that where you pick it up, though? You get it from the... From that Bloody Finger Invader guy? 
or did I just straight up miss it, I guess? Do I got to go back there and fight him again? Oh, <laughs> you actually fight him multiple times? He kind of hunts you? I guess that makes sense, because he was talking um, uh, he was talking a lot of smack. <laughs> Second time you meet him, he drops it? Okay. Well. We'll just have to get him next time, then. Yeah, he's got a big yapper on him. Yeah, he seems very sure of himself. Yeah, that's okay. We'll get to him. Sorry for the confusion. No, it's okay. We got there in the end. Besides, I'm going to continue on with the DLC anyway, and I'm sure I'll, I'll find him again. But first things first, we're going to get Millie's prosthesis, and then we're going to get... Then we're going to kill the... We're gonna kill the assassin after Ronnie down in Noxtella. And then we're gonna head over to the DLC after that. Thing is, I do not remember this place at all. Par for the course. I can hardly remember anything about this. Whoa. Oh, okay. Here we go. The Great Shield looks dope. Yeah, I'm glad you told me about this, actually. Because <laughs> I never would have put... I never would have looked at this shield and thought, Oh yeah, this has the Gelmir, this has the Gelmir symbol on it. So thank you for, thank you for that. Now I'm, now I'm matching. To some degree. The red and white... The red looks like it goes. The white is kind of eh. But I mean... It's got the symbol on it, so it goes together nicely anyway. No, don't roll in the poison, you foolish fool. Same has the hue. It even has the same hue of metal on the front of it as the armor. Yeah, it does look kind of beat up, huh? <laughs> From this side, it looks a little. It looks darker, but maybe that's just the lighting that I'm in. Yeah, you're right, you're right. It goes together. And as we all know, that's how, that's what matters most in this game. Uh oh. Hate these damn slugs. Uh, wasn't there an ulcerated tree spirit around here somewhere? I think it was over here. Oh, it was one of these things. No, never mind. We got you. No problem. Come here. Seriously? Oh, that's right. He spits. I forgot about that. When he teleports, he does the spit. That's alright, we're good. Well, that was easier than an ulcerated tree spirit. 
No problem taking an easier fight. Maybe I should have put on more poison resist. Yes, yes, you're you're very angry, boy. Now, where's this clean rot knight? I think I think we're on the right path. I think we're almost there. Oh, I'm on fire. The only thing I wish is that. <laughs> Damn, I put my man to sleep, literally. He's all tucked in in the... Uh oh Accidental. Oh. Oh, is she over there? I think they might be over there. Over there? Whoa! Okay, where'd you come from? I guess they woke up. Rude. Alright, well, you have to die now. Alright, let's try that again. Oh, he's a big boy. I'm on fire. As I was saying, I wish that there was like a fire status ailment. Like if you hit them enough times, then they all, then they start taking dots from flame damage or something like that. Oh, hey. Oh. <laughs> the no looker through the smoke. No, I missed. What was that hitbox? Is she up there then? I think they might be up there. Who's summoning stuff at me? Come here. Where the clean rot knight at? I know you're here. Yeah, that guy didn't happen. It reminded me of how, uh... No, they're not here? Oh, come on, man. Another one of you chumps. I should really break out. The way he was napping, it reminded me of how... It reminds me of how... You would fall asleep on anything during a sleepover and you wouldn't get a blanket or a pillow or anything. You'd just be out there sleeping on the couch raw. He's so tricky. Just leave it on the floor with a shoebox pillow. <laughs> yep, just <laughs> using your own using your own sweater as a blanket. Or a pillow. <laughs> Whichever you need more. Now where's this clean rod knight at? Come on, man. That's a trap. Uh, that's another one of those. Oh, wait. Yeah, that's at the be- That's back at the beginning. Okay. Um... Oh, come on, two of them? 
Alright, this calls for... Ah! Oh, I thought I'd be able to make some Looney Tunes bombs. Oh wait, we can! Here we go. <laughs> this should be fun. Alright. I noticed that you guys are particularly fond of the fire. But, I submit to you, ice. Ice again. And more ice. And some more ice. You guys frozen? Okay, good. I probably didn't need to use all four. <laughs> I could probably just... Yeah, I didn't need to use all four. I think one was good enough. <laughs> oh, I never got the depraved perfumer glove before? Okay. These heresy-inclined perfumers imbibe their own spices to alter body and mind. Their slow descent into self-destruction is what earned them their name. I never really given thought into perfumer into perfumer lore before. If I recall, these guys are like Yeah, they have like no feelings and they just kind of I think they, like, hunt Omen down or something like that. They were hunting Omens, or they were hunting... Well, like... All the, all the quote-unquote freaks. Because I remember them being in the Albanark village as well. I remember them... Trying to fight the Misbegotten and such. Actually, I don't think I remember them fighting Misbegotten. I got this really nice short sword infused with flaming strike, like you have for a quick attack weapon. It turns out this new short sword is actually a large dagger, and has the dagger move set. Is that it? I've not heard of the the large dagger class. Dang. I'm sure these uh. <laughs> I'm sure these these quick dexterity classes are having having a time with that, huh? I think the depraved perfumers were definitely hunting omens with the giant omen killer guys. Yeah, like I said, I've never given much thought into what the perfumers were up to. I just I just found them all incredibly annoying. As you can probably tell. <laughs> like, I remember reading one of the Spirit Ashes... I think it was like Rolo, and um, there was another Perfumer Ash. Was it like Trisha or something like that? No, I think Trisha was like some healing lady. But anyway, there was a, there was a Perfumer Ash, and... And the Omen Killer, Ash, and they were saying something to the effect of, you know, they remove their humanity by, with herbs and spices. <laughs> they season their, they season their food to the point where they have no feelings and go around killing people. So while Omen Killers were bludgeoning Omens, they were also blowing up from the de-perfumers bombs. <laughs> Uh-oh, what happened there? Imagine seasoning your food so much you snap. Well, <laughs> hey. 
You know, maybe this is why white people don't season their food. They're scared of going insane. <clears throat> now, what the hell's going on here? Maybe the, maybe the white people know something we don't. I don't know. And video capture device isn't even picking up the... Yeah, stream's blowing up. Okay. I don't know if that's salt. That may be some bath salts. <laughs> <laughs> Omen killers are the original Florida mans. <laughs> Wait, did I... Okay, everything seems to be working fine. Video capture device has audio. And yeah, seem to be up and running fine. Oh, wait, yeah, we've been up here already. Okay, we good. This is weird. I don't know what causes that, but... You know, it might be the HDMI cable that I'm using, because I don't think I've had this problem with the other cords. Which is weird, because this is the HDMI cord that came with the Elgato. So I figured it'd be tailor-made. It's Mesmer. <laughs> Mesmer doesn't want the smoke. He doesn't want these flames. Another one of those stoners up there. Well, clearly something's messing with it. If it happens again, then yeah, we'll just switch, we'll just swap HDMI's. Um. Hmm. Let's come down here first, real quick. I think there's another one of those grafted scions that appear. Yeah. Wait, no, these aren't grafted scions. They're grafted... They're like grafted spiders or something. Is he gonna teleport? You see me, right? You see me, see you. Come here. Hurry up and teleport. I know you got it in you. Here he comes. Okay, we're getting jumped. Ah. close. I don't know why I stick around when I'm getting jumped by two people at once. That's always a bad idea. I need to, I just need to run. I need to stop thinking I can block everything and just cheese it. Wait for one of them to get separated, take my shots, and then we back it up. Some more, and then we play the poke and run game until one of them's dead, then we can fight the other one straight up. Because one of these days, we're going to get jumped by uh, by really powerful individuals, and you're just going to sit there and try to block it out again. That's not going to work. Oh. 
if you want to get an extra flamey, you could do, you could grab Blood Flame Blade. You could grab Blood Flame Blade from Lyurnia for a cheap little weapon buff spell. Its fire causes bleed on hit. Uh, it's a spell? Wait, that's an incant. Oh, I guess I don't have it. Oh, grab... Weapon buff spell, yeah. Blood Flame Blade from Laernia for a cheap little weapon buff spell. Well, how much int does it cost? Or... Yeah. Oh, it's an incantation? Oh, okay. Oh, you refer to, you refer to both Sork and Incansa spells? Okay, fair enough. Uh, then I probably got it. Oh, flame, catch flame, blood sling, surge flame, flame protect me. Blood flame talons. Huh, I guess I don't. This is some of the stuff that Moog was using, right? Sin Laernia? Who's selling that? Is the... Sorry. Mosquito. Uh, one second. I gotta wipe my hands off. Yep, sorry, one second. We gotta leave the room. Uh, I decided to get a new roll of paper towel while we were back out there. It's a Mogan cant, but it's basically like our spell now. <laughs> it's not sold, but it's held by a scarab north of the Rose Church where Vare is. Literally just killed a fly and a mosquito earlier. Yeah, it's bug season. They're out and about. Okay. Um, Rose Church, north of Vare's church, or right behind, did you say, north of Vare's church? Hey, right. we'll throw that there and take a look. Oh yeah, how much int, or how much faith does it require, though? Dog? Oh, the dog's over here. You okay, buddy? You look like you're having a rough time. House Marius is ruined. Just desserts for falling for that severed, severed, severed harpy. No surprise that guilty cretin took the castle and, oh, and our storied sword. Oh yeah, that's right. The um, 
Bell Bearing Hunter Jerk is here. Oh, wait, yeah, that's right. I totally forgot to go around fighting, fighting that dude at all the merchant spots. If I kill him here, does he not appear there anymore? It's like 12 Arcane, 11 Faith. Very efficient incant. Well, I mean... Uh... Yeah, okay. I mean, if I keep using Godric's rune... Godric's great rune, I can use it, but... Uh... Yeah. I completely defaulted to all strength and... <laughs> all strength, endurance, and vigor. We are all in on the beefy boy activities. He's such an angry, petty man, he always appears even after death. Oh, okay, cool. So we can keep on fighting him. Good, very good. I actually want to try... Uh... I do want to try his sword, because I've seen a couple of videos of... Well, not a couple of videos. I saw this one video of a guy just running around with... Uh... He had on one of those... Uh, what are those things called? Ow. Oh no! Get away from me, dogs. Okay, that's enough of that. God, I hate dogs. Yeah, Marius says sword. Absolutely insane, but requires a super specific build. Oh, okay. Yeah, like I was saying, I saw Buddy running around with... I forget what those, like, those roly-poly dudes are called, you know, with, like, the very round faces that kind of look like frogs. Like, uh, I saw a guy running around with just, like, naked body, one of those frog dudes masks, and just absolutely, like, one-shotting bosses with with that sword. To be fair, I mean, his defense was insane. He had the dodges down pat, and he was able to... The Albinorix? The funny frog head? Oh! Those are Albinorix? Really? Really? I thought the Albinorix were like the... The legless people. Or like, I guess, the handicapped people. I should say. They have legs, they just don't work. That's why they have the dogs. Yep, I saw you, buddy. Come on out. Yeah, there's three generations of Albinarks and they all look different. Oh, alright, today I learned. Anybody else want to jump me? I'm on fire! Oh god, no! Oh, perf- you! <laughs> nice lunge, buddy. You gonna... Alright, good talk. Now, if I was a clean rot knight, where would I be? Oh! Well, speak of the devil. What is she swiping at, though? Alright, it's you and me. Mount Gelmir versus... Ow. Oh, I rolled that! That was... Uh, that was kind of anticlimactic, damn. <laughs> I forgot those things were able to spit, too. Yeah, I saw you. What? I was... 
blocking? What do you mean? Alright, where's the prosthesis? Where is it at? Oh, we get another one then. Okay. Dogs too? Come on, bro. <laughs> I keep forgetting to press R I keep forgetting to press right trigger after I friggin' use that move. We need to Yeah, after I send out the flames, I need to remember to hit that right trigger. Just out here wasting FP at this point. All right, ladder for there. That prosthesis has got to be close, right? Oh. Okay, well, we just found our way to the boss then. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure Patches would be here for some reason. I forget. Was Patches here? I think he was. I don't know why, though. And I feel like he was dying here, too. Was he? Alright, let's, let's make a mental don't. Let's look that up later after this. Because, yeah, that's going to bug me. But anyway, let's go fight Mr. Briar, or whatever his damn name. Brian. Let's go fight Brian. Uh, what did I want to do? Oh, yeah, I wanted to... What's going on, Brian? Ow. Can I block this? Kinda. <laughs> He's using the force. does that. I can block it, though. Ow. I rolled that. I thought I rolled that too. Well, anyway. Why is Melania here?
Interesting. Yeah, there is a bunch of Melania symbolism up in here. Okay. Um. Okay, so we missed the prosthesis somewhere. We screwed around and somehow ended up finding the boss. <laughs> Oh, okay. I was wondering why it wasn't going down. Okay, somewhere along the way... Oh, perhaps in here? No, we just came from that way. Uh, then what gives? I am the confused now. I didn't pick it up already, right? No. Nope. Wait, what? What? What's the difference between these two lar these two types of larval tears? An exceptionally rare creature that burgeons except the rare creature that burgeons from spirit graves and lives only a fleeting existence. Okay, never Never mind. I don't get it. But anyway, about that arm. Let's... Uh... That's just death. This would be a really weird place to live with all these statues running around. That'd be freaky. Just the middle of the night, you get up to go to the bathroom and then there's just a bunch of... big ass statues. Maybe it's up here? I feel like this guy's supposed to have an item. Okay. Uh. Alright, let's just look it up real quick then. And we're also going to look up the patches stuff because now I'm curious. I swear Patches is there. And also, good thing the stream hasn't blown up yet. Let's look at Patches real quick. Y'all see this? Yeah, you can. Oh yeah, you gotta go, you gotta resolve Volcano Madden for Patches to go there. Oh yeah. I killed Patches, so I know he's not gonna be there, but I was just curious about what, uh, 
what happens when Patches go there. Patches goes comes here, because, well, I mean, number one, I forgot, uh, what, uh, wait. Uh, what was I saying? Well, I mean, uh, number one, I forgot whether or not Patches comes there or not. And, well, thank you for confirming that. But I also feel like Patches comes here and he dies for some reason. Whoops. As you're completing... Conductor Virgins... Yeah, Murkwater Cave, speak to Patches, he'll surrender. Invite you to come back later, Volcano Manor. Altus Plateau, move to Mount Gelmir, kick you off. He wants you to give Tanith her old dancer castanets. And then she gets all pissed. <laughs> then he goes back to the original cave. Oh, okay. Okay, so that's what he does. Okay. Why do I feel like Patches was dying for some reason? I feel like he was in a bad way when he was in, when he was outside the, when he was outside Brian's room, Elmer Brian. What else was I looking at? Oh yeah. Uh... Prosthesis. Oh, prosthesis. He was, he got injured by the boss? Oh, okay. Got injured fighting the Elmer boy. The boy Elmer. For Millicent, found in a chest. In the room guarded by a single clean rot knight. Northwestern edge of Shaded Castle. Go up the tall ladder from the outmost section of the castle, then along the wall to the left. I am not good with directions. Let's just YouTube it. Hello everyone, Johnny Hello, Hurricane here from GamersHeroes.com and today we'll be a girl that only has one Atlas Plateau and spot. It's a poison swamp, so I'm way out here because I had to freaking, you know, you can't open your map when you're in combat and I needed footage. But anyways, wrap around the wall. So you find this spot right here and hop in. You're going to have to run from here. I killed most of the enemies. You know, you're going to have to fight, but whatever. Or you can run if you want, your choice. Poison, I mean, uh, yeah, I want... You're going to get poison. Oh, uh, yeah, I went up here. Good, that was a mistake. I just thought I could kill that guy really quickly. <laughs> I did not think I was going to get blown out that bad. You can ignore him. Sounds like he doesn't want to even make this video. Hey. You want to go over to this right here. Some of these... <laughs> some Climb of these up. kind of sucked, <laughs> I would imagine. Having to go... Get yourself That poisoned. poison must stay on you. I just realized... I thought I had the poison from... Um, being in the swamp. This man has no... Bolus... This man has no pellets... Keep wrapping around here. I do think there is like a heavy knight protecting it. I'm pretty sure, but I killed him. So be ready for that. And then right up in here, you'll... Oh, okay. <laughs> also has no HP. <laughs> yeah, this is... My guy has a very interesting setup going on here. He's got the... He's got the giant hammer... And he's got the... He's 
giant hammer and the clean rot gear clean rot knight's gear we and 99 levels of uh <laughs> How do we get there? Yeah, to be fair, not everybody's made for public speaking. I should know. Can we make it? No? Yeah, fair enough. I throw in a lot of sentence fillers. I've been noticing, I've been catching myself a lot watching my streams back of all the stuff that I say. I try to catch myself so I don't say us and I say so a lot. I start my sentences off with so a lot of the time. So I'm trying to cut that out even though I just said so again. God damn it. <laughs> It's a tough habit to break. <laughs> oh, I meant like he's going ugh like he's... I meant... I meant like he's going ugh like he's annoyed to being even asked to make this content. Ah, okay. <laughs> Never mind then. I wasn't really paying attention to what he was talking about. I was more focused on what what was going on in the video, to be honest. Geronimo! Yeah. I don't know, maybe my man was having a bad day. It'd be like that sometimes. Let me up. Or maybe he just died a lot in this area before he made this video, before he made the video. Excuse me, good sir. They're not gonna follow me, right? They don't follow. I'm just killing you just because I can. Okay, I think this is the way. Could I have made that jump? No, probably not. Alright, we're on the right path. Alright, gotta be careful though. We only have four pots left. Alright, clean rot night. We got this. Whoa! We don't got this. We don't got this at all. You. Little wiener. You! Come here. Get the hell out of my game. Alright, let's try this again. This time, a little less getting jumped. Why are all these clean rot knights here? Fire. That does work. All right, here we go. Somehow defeated the boss before getting the I don't know why. I was like, the map said go northwest, and here I was thinking northeast, like this is, <laughs> this is northwest right here. <laughs> uh, we got there in the end. They worship Melania here, 
So her knight's attempting to take it back. Oh! Well, I mean, I guess that makes sense because of the whole pictures of Melania in the boss room. And all that clean rot knight gear. I mean, and all the clean rot knights and all the clean rot knight armor pieces that are in there as well. Anyways, Millie, I got a gift for you. Millie! Uh, where is she? Oh, she's up here. Millie! What's up? Now, I'm tracing the path Melania took. She's passed into the lands that lie beyond the Erd Tree. Are you giving me this arm? I thank you. I am in your debt yet again. I think if the arm serves well enough, it might be possible for me to wield a sword again. If the arm serves well enough, it might be possible perhaps then I can aid you in battle. Woo! If the arm it might be perhaps then I can all right, cool. Now let's head on out. Let's go test out Millie's newfound arm. Wait a minute. I almost, I almost forgot. Let's go have a look for the sorcery, the incant that you were telling me about, Archon. Damn, what's happening over here? Oh, a bunch of octopuses. Is It'll be an odd-looking scarab. So these are Albinarix. Oh! The pull-out game. These boys do not get staggered. Just looking for anything odd shaped. Oh crap. Nope. Not that one. You know what? Leave me alone. Ow. Fire. You dead. Yeah, you dead. They're absolutely albinarics. Wicked. Okay. Is it in this forest here? Or... Is it this guy? Nah, this is just... Yeah, it's just one of those... Health ones. Where are you going? Ah, there we go. 
Blood Flame Blade, huh? All right, let's go have a look. Whoops, not past the time. Uh, we need... Memorize spells. Faith 12, Arcane 12. Enhance right hand armament with blood flame. Level up, uh, flask. What was I doing? Oh yeah, I needed to get myself a staff. Not great room. What can we use staff wise? Oh wait, no. That was an incant. Let's, I guess we use, wait, what? I had another one leveled up to level 18? That sucks. Um, what type of, just some more fly, fire for the flame knight? Yeah, let's give it a try. I just need to, huh. I guess I don't really have anything that could buff it up. What type of spell was it again? It was like a, one of them Mogwin spells. Blood Oath Incantation, generated by the Lord of Blood. Engulfs armament, right hand with Blood Flame. Incant can be cast while in motion. After dealing damage, Blood Flame continues to build up onset of blood loss for a very short time. Probably the Dragon Communion Seal. It's weightless, and I think it only requires 10. Ten Faith Arcane. Well, I mean, weight's not the biggest issue for me, but yeah, I could take what I can get. Does the... Does the level of the seal have any effect on weapon enchantments? I don't think they do. I think they just have... They only work for... I wonder if there's some type of blood incantation seal. I'm not sure. I think it's mostly just flat buffs. Okay, okay. Enhances giant flames incantations. Enhances dragon cult incantations. Golden order incantations. Black Flame Incantations. Godslayer Incantations. Enhances Bestial Incantations and Dragon Communion Incantations. Yeah. I wonder if there's some blood... There's like a blood seal that helps out blood incantations. Here, let's run some experiments then. Um, what can we fight? Let's just fight these fools over here. Okay. Oh, wait, yeah. Equip the thing. You, sir. Whoops. Oh. 
Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. <laughs> well, oh, he's still alive. He missed. Okay, let's try that again. <laughs> Uh, is it not working because I already have a buff on this blade? With the... or what's the deal here? Or is that a spell? Is this a spell? No, it's an incantation. And then... what's happening? Rah, I choose you. Yeah, it's because I'm fire infused? Okay. Yeah, fair enough. One second then. Let us try. Let's make it heavy then. Then let's test it out with claw mark seal. Can we use it? We can. Okay. Sir, sir, come back. I need to test things. That was 400 and what? Damn it! <laughs> I pick. I had to pick the enemy that had the two. That had the two health bars overlapping. Okay, can you get up, please? Three ninety. Three ninety-three. Okay. Dragon Communion. Whoops. And he looks at me, and I look at him. Come on. go. I'm sorry, horsey. Four. What? Ow. Oh, god damn it, the backstab. You know, I know a better place to test this out than fighting him. <laughs> Let's try this again. <laughs> so I did see an improvement, though, 471 as opposed to 393, but let's just make sure that this is, uh... Five... Six, okay, what are these different numbers? 580, okay, 580. Is there like a perfect, is there like a perfect swing mechanic in this game? 580. 696, or is there like a special hit that I'm getting when they're staggered? Ok, 
Okay, 580. Blood flame blame induces bleeding. Oh, yeah, bleeding status ailment. Duh. Five eighty one. Thirty seven thirty, I mean. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Everybody be cool. And there you go again, blocking when you should be running. Should have ran, tough guy. All right. I didn't even get any good data from that. Just got my ass whooped. Alright, let's try this again. You. Okay, so that was 581. Wait, it's still going. Five eighty. So there's that, uh, <laughs> so one damage difference. That may be sun and big damage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I figured. Okay, and if we make it fire again... That's just straight. Well, I mean, I guess first of all, I need to get the flame buff on the blade first. But, I mean, I guess that's just the same as any sort of. Yeah, okay. So it's looking like this does more damage, though. I'm... Please, chill out. Oh, from behind, too. Okay. Seven fifty two. Actually, I wonder what happens when I make this heavy and then I imbue it with flames. Jeez. 
just the tip. Six. Oh, whoops. Seven seventy four. Come here, then. Seven thirty. I completely forgot what the flame was again. What it, when um, I completely forgot what the numbers were when I had fire on it. All right, so 7:30 for the big boy. You missed. Seven fifty two, nine forty four. Where's the big guy? Where's the big man? There you are. All right, so seven thirty. Keep that number in mind. Now, come here. Let me hit you, bro. Nine oh two. Whoops. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Dang it. We just putting in the science right now. Yeah, man, we gotta we gotta hit get our lab coats on. All right, so seven thirty. Nine oh two. Okay. Okay, nine oh two. This is the way to go for now. You can't argue with the science, Archon. What are all those? We got ourselves a, a lab coat, a DNA sequence, stethoscope. St I said stethoscope. <laughs> uh, microscope. And a telescope. Hard scoping. So maybe, well, I mean, maybe if, um, well, I mean, obviously, it's the bleed, right? That's where I get the big damage from when I'm rocking the... The, what you call it? When using this blood flame blade, it's obviously where I'm... Yeah, the, blood, the bleed is where I'm going to get the big damage from. Because, yeah. You just got to hit him enough and to... To inflict bleed onto them. So I didn't really take that into account now that I think about it. But overall flat damage numbers and seem to indicate that just using the regular old flame imbued sword seems to be the way to go. Now maybe if I'm fighting like a boss or a uh, or red phantom or something like that this could probably do some work. Or just anybody with a, a large health pool, really. <laughs> Not necessarily just meant for bosses. Plus, you can reapply Flame Strike mid combat reliably instead of odd, odd Blood Flame cast. Odd Blood Flame cast speaking is hard for me sometimes yes that is also a bonus uh and usually when i cast my uh
Uh, what do you mean? When I when I cast my Ash of War, I can usually get a stagger. So I can probably get around the large cast time of the Blood Flame Blade uh, by putting on a medallion, I think, right? There's like, there's like the Radigan, there's like the Radigan Talisman, I think, right? That you can lower cast times on junk. Yeah, ca shortens cast time of incants and sorceries. So that could probably help out in that regard. And we can use this to extend incantation times. Or durations, I should say. Godfrey icon. But if I'm going to do that, then I'm going to have to also get rid of... Get rid of one of these, and I don't want to get rid of one of these. Maybe we can get rid of this. Eh, yeah, maybe. Alright, drop this back in here as well. But, oh, but anyway. First things first, I would like to, oh, actually, first things first, I would like to take a break. Actually, it's been an hour 30, almost, hour 28 on the clock, it looks like. Try and take breaks every hour here. So yeah, oh, let me pull up Spotify for you. And like I say, if anyone's got requests, for me to add to the streamer playlist, by all means let me know. And we'll add it to the 83 song and growing playlist that's happening so far. I think I'll give you some Street Fighter 4 drive in stage. All right. Uh let's say Yeah, let's say let's say 7 to 10 minutes because I got a I got a couple things I need to do. It's going to take a little bit longer. So yeah, 7 to 10. I'll see you in a second.
I like the spinal song, but I don't think. Oh yeah, camera. I don't know if it's break worthy. I think it's just regular old playlist worthy. Oh wait, yeah. Carefully maneuver the microphone away from the T, because we are not about to spill. Tea on the mic. There we go. Anyways. Okay, so I want to see how Millie fights with... And I think we can get a fight with her here. Because uh, I think there's a god skin dude up here. And I think we can get a fight with her here. Fighting the magma worm. Uh, I think it'll probably be easier... To get to get to this village, though, all we have to do is run up here, and we are kind of far away. We have to run through all this. So I think that's the plan. Let's go. Let's go fight with Millie real quick. Like fight with her at our side, not fight her. <laughs> fight with not fight with her but we're gonna fight with her you know what I mean English is hard Blood runes? Wait, what? What's this? Ew. Alright, hold on a second, y'all. This guy needs to die expeditiously. That's what was making all that noise. Come at me, bro. Oh, I'm on fire. Oh, my God. So what other shenanigans are going on up in here? Block the thing. Hello, doggy. Whoa, another one? Did you just drop from the ceiling? Are you guys on the ceiling? Where'd the dog go? I think he went downstairs. Yeah, there you are. Okay, we're getting distracted again. Let's not get distracted. How about that? Let's go fight with Millie. Hey, guys. Don't snitch. Man. 
Not even trying to shoot at me. So what are these guys doing? Are they about to jump this caravan? Oh no, these are all just... Okay. You know what? I don't think I've actually taken this caravan's treasure before. Hold up. Let me, uh, let me see about that. Great stars. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me, everybody, excuse me. What are we looking at? Oh, uh, so y'all are looking at Mount Gelmir. Yeah, I'll be fair. I think you guys were kind of getting your asses whooped up there. I'd probably be looking up there, too, in some disgust if I was you, holding all those L's. Holding a lot of L's. Where you going with that chest, boy? Ooh, Golden Rune 10. Thank you. gonna block all day. Oh, never mind. Looks like I've gotten it before. Huge bludgeon. Damn, that's ugly. Bloodstained star is an ill omen. A fact not lost upon those against whom this weapon is brought to bear. Landing attacks slightly restores HP. Oh! Okay, that's cool. Well, anyways, got distracted again. You know, I never really followed one of these things all the way to the end. I wonder what happens when they reach their destination. If I didn't have other things I would like to do, I would have done. I'd probably do that. Probably do that off stream. Oh, Jesus! Does this lead up? Oh, not those things. They're so gross. That's right. This guy. Out here in his thong. And his little... What you call it? His, uh... Sun? Sun mask? Little sunflower mask? I forgot what you needed to do to get his attention. Just pondering the Erd tree. Damn, that's bright. You needed to do something. You needed to get an incantation. I think you needed a certain type of seal to wave in front of him to get his attention. I forget, though. Either way, I don't got it, so. Figure that out later, if we have a mind to do gold mask quest line. Maybe we can, you know what I'm saying? Maybe we can uh, restore the golden order for 
shits and giggles. Alright, so we're gonna hit up this village, go have a fight with Millie, and then we'll head back downstairs and deal with the, um, I forget what they were called, the assassin that, uh, that Ronnie wanted dead. Let's make it morning though. I have I am very scared of fighting in the fighting in the dark. I remember being very weirded out by this place the first time I came here. Well, I mean, I'm still weirded out. I hear a festive melody. No. No, don't skin me. My hide is filthy, I swear. <laughs> I swear I don't I never bathe. I'm just a gamer. I don't I don't take showers or nothing, I swear. I'm a smash player. Having a good old time. I wish there was a dance emote. <laughs> Having a... Alright, well, as you were, ladies. Look at the steps, though. I'm just waiting for them to try to attack me, and I'm kind of scared. I kind of feel like I should hit them first, to be honest. Because if they decide to all jump me, I'm pretty much dead. I'm going to have to run for my life. Nice. y'all to it then. I wonder why they ignore me. <clears throat> oh, okay. All it took was a dog to set it off. Ow. Okay, the rest of them down there seem to be cool. I guess it's too much to ask in order to... Go into a place filled with people and not fight. Please don't break, please don't break. I'm pretty sure it doesn't, but... Whoa, camera. I'm still scared because of that friggin' Bellarat jail. Had two breakable floors. There's no need for that. No need for that level of- Oh! And this is why I always run with my shield up. Just in case.
I wonder what kind of crazy ass festival this is though. Is this the are they actually just running around skidding people and then just going around dancing, having a great old time afterwards? Oh come on. You don't need to do all this. <laughs> I always like that little ah. <laughs> All right. Now where is that Millie summon sign? Oh, never mind, right here. Let's see that new arm in action, Millie. Let's get it. All right. While she fights him, I'm just going to sit back and drink some tea and commentate. So it looks like she has a Shamshir? Is that Sam? Is that Sham? I keep saying Samshir. I think it's a Shamshir. Now what the hell is your problem? Oh, wait. I don't got a good angle on the fight. Okay, Billy. Going to town. Oh, yeah, the spinning blade. Oh, she does the pedal dance. Oh, she gets interrupted out of it, though. Millie right back in there. This head-on approach isn't really working for Millie. She's getting a lot of hits in, though. Oh, and she heals up. She gets yanked back. Oh, she gets the stagger into the pedal dance. Oh, but it gets interrupted. Oh, she has no more heals, unfortunate for Millie. Oh, he summons a God, God Flame Tornado. Billy eats that too. Oh, he's a long boy. Hey, I'm trying to drink my tea here, buddy. You don't want none of this. You don't want the smoke, my friend. You don't want none of this. Billy, help me! Boy. Oh, okay. Millie! Millie, let's... Oh, come on, Millie. I was just about to drink my tea. You suck. Come on, buddy. That was close. God damn it.
Cod Skin Peeler. I really don't like these bosses that just dance around me and keep hitting me from the side while I got my shield up. While I'm in block stun and everything, I can't do anything about it except hold that. I, I just gotta keep it moving, really. I have to be constantly holding some type of direction, so... I, I keep them in front of me. Godskin Peeler, Scouring Black Flame. Well, nice try, Millie. You got him down to about half health, I think. Ah, meet yet again. The arm you gave me truly is a thing of wonder. It feels just like my own. Even handling a sword. Perhaps it is foolish to say this to you of all people, but I am sure of my skill with the sword. Thus, I would have you call upon me in battle again, should you ever have the need. I would have you call upon me in battle, should you ever have the need. It is the only way that I can express my thanks. I like her. She would be wife material if not for the whole scarlet rot thing. That's kind of a deal breaker. I would have you call upon me. It is the only... We can be friends. <laughs> Although, I'm pretty sure she only sees me as a friend anyway. <laughs> Nothing more than that. Uh... Okay. Where else can we fight? Well, no, no, no. We don't need to fight more with Millie. Well, I mean... No, we don't. We don't, we don't, we don't, we don't. Let's head on downstairs. To, uh... Set over here. Pretty sure... We're supposed to get around here. Uh... Okay, so the marker says it's a number... The marker says two, so I have another marker placed somewhere out there. So I'll just do that. Alright, I gotta get over here. Oh yeah. Ant Rider! Alright, let's have some fun with these ants. You there, with the ant. Kia! Oh yeah, the snails. that for some dew. Oh. <laughs> Nothing up here but snails. Alright, well. Y'all enjoy that. Oh, you suck.
You guys have a good old time. Ow. Ow. Nope. Oh, hey. Ow. Man, as soon as I'm out of my animation, decides to hit me. Demon Souls called. They want their bosses back. Oh. Stop moving. You're just lucky I don't have Torrent, you scrub. I don't think this is it. Oh wait, this might be it. I thought this was gonna take me upstairs. Is this it? This feels very boss roomy. No. In some material though. It's not all for nothing. About to encounter more ants, I'm assuming. Well, that doesn't look suspicious at all. Just a bunch of glowing dust in the middle of a doorway. We'll check over here first and then we'll hit up that hallway. Suspicious ass hallway. Oh, there's Grace here? Cool. How did I miss that? No, wait. I activated it, right? Yeah. I didn't. <laughs> what? <laughs> I just walked right past it. Silliness. Oh, yeah. Let's just rest here. I did. Oh, you could talk to her. What's up, Ronnie? You might have to speak up a little bit because there's a bunch of waterfalls here. Kind of loud. Even when I turned my back upon the two fingers, Blythe remained my loyal ally. <laughs> Though he was created a vassal for an Imperium, he was a colossal failure on the part of the two fingers. Blythe and E.G. both. Art willing to give too much to me, yet they both understand what lieth beyond the dark path. What about Celibus? I must betray everything and rid the world of what came before. Now, should I add thee to the list? Another one, kind of heart, as kind of heart as they. Uh, probably not. I think I'll do a different ending this time. <sighs> this form hath loosened my tongue. I've let slip too much. Forget what thou'st heard. Forget. 
<laughs> Damn. I don't know. I don't know what it is about me. But people love to... <laughs> people apparently love to unload their trauma onto me. I guess this is just typical streamer... Typical streamer things. <laughs> I'm back, went and helped some randoms. Mr. Randy needed assistance. Mr. Randy, who's Mr. Randy? Oh, wait, yeah, randoms as in, you mean Randy as in randoms, right? I hope, hope it will, all went well. Helping out with, uh... Helping out with bosses in the DLC. Helping out with Melania. Helping out with the Radon or Moog fight. Ah, oh, not these wieners. New setups working great. Good to hear. Cause yeah, sound like you were going through a bit of a struggle. Man, not these death wieners. I don't even have a ranged weapon. Let me out! They're so weird. Ah, look at those eyeballs. Who the hell created these crazy ass, freaky ass creatures? Blech. And look at this. They're just hanging out in a room full of bodies, just chilling. I'm assuming they're procreating up in here. This new build is so much better than the. Let me keep my shield up while I'm reading. This new build is so much better than my int faith build. Oh, so much better than my intelligence and in faith build. So you tried intelligence, then intelligence faith. <clears throat> I forgot how strong faith builds were. They're even better in the DLC. Strength benefits a ton too. All the weapons I'm using are good on strength. All right, sounds good to me. They are odd. Uh, they've been like in every. They've been in like every game since Demon Souls. Really? Well, dang. I guess I never made it far enough in order to get to these kind of creatures in the other Souls games because. I've played 2 and 3, but I didn't make it that far. I've played 1 a lot further, and I've seen some playthroughs of... I've seen some streamers do playthroughs of it, and I have not seen anything like this. Interesting. Maybe I gotta pay attention. Maybe I have seen them, I just can't remember. That would also fit into some that also would make sense for something that happened something I'd do. Oh okay, here we are. How's it going, sir? Oh Shadow. Thou art the last. Tell the two fingers that Rani the Witch cometh to end thy flesh with a fateful wound. There to heal. Whoa! Yeah, you go ahead and heal then. Why did he take life from me when I blocked? Yeah, holy shit. Okay. Okay, so we can't block. Well, I mean, we can, it's just a bad idea. 
Can we get a backstab? This is awkward. Fire. My thanks. It was more of a challenge than I envisioned. Now I can finally stand before them. This is farewell, my dear. Tell Bly and E.G. I love them. Discarded palace key. I wonder why that baleful shadow took the form of blade of a blight. Blythe. I still can't get over the fact that somehow two D's turn out to make a TH. Language is weird. So, what's in here? Going back up. crazy how much more damage Flaming Strike does now after the update. I think FromSoft really wanted people to make fire builds after two years of sorcery and bleed damage. I think it's because Blythe is turning on Ronnie and the Two Fingers are just making invader copies. Really? Blythe was turning on her? How did that... When did that, when did that happen? Was it one of those situations where, like, I'm the random guy that comes in and somehow gets more done than he does and he gets jealous because I become the new favorite? What the hell is this? Oh. Oh. Okay. Well, I think we gotta go fight that alien dragon thingy now, huh? Ronnie mentioned that Blythe was a failure of a creation. He's being mind controlled by the two fingers? Really? Ugh. Man, I keep missing out on these story parts. Why didn't she say that? I feel like I've heard Blythe being called a failure. But how was he a failure? Was he a failure because he followed Ronnie? When she did all those blasphemous death things? Yes? Okay, okay, okay. Oh yeah, the crossing the river not River Styx, River Rot, I guess. Huh. Alright, let's get our... Let's get our stuff back, and let's turn you into... Let's put you there. And let's equip one of these and some of these.
Why can't I have torrent here? Whoops, wrong button. Uh. Wait, was I not supposed to come this way? Or do I just have to get Scarlet rotted? I think it just have to. It just has to happen. I should have got that mushroom armor, put that on or something. Unless I gotta fight something, then I'm screwed. You suck! Yeah, 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 Scarlet Rod, yeah. Well, goddamn. Cool. Uh... How do we navigate this, though? Why are you guys in the middle of the Scarlet Rot, man? Why? Tell me why. Get away from me. And what the heck is that? Is that a boss too? I think that's a boss. away from me. Alright, we're gonna wait for this. Yeah. I think that's probably a boss. I'm not gonna fight it, though. Not in this damn place. I should have ran over there, shouldn't I? I shouldn't have ran. O I should have ran over there and gotten on top of the, gotten on top of the pillar. Missed opportunities. You can't reach it without speed strats, like a super fast weapon art. Oh, okay, so you need like a, you need one of those, um, yeah, you need one of those dashes. Okay. <clears throat> well, yeah, never mind. Um <laughs> Got to find another way around. I think what I did last time was I just booked it over there from here. Again, I wish I had torrent. But I can't dwell on the fact that I have no no horse. Uh, well, I mean, if you got another way, Archon, I'm all ears. Otherwise, I'm just going to make a run for it. I see that there's... You can come out here and look at the whole... Look at the whole place.
Wrong button. I mean, wrong pouch. We can't make it. Well, I guess this is the way. So there's that thing over there. Do we want to check out over there? I mean, I guess we can. Oh, I forgot to... We're fine. Well, a chest. I guess we gotta get the chest then, don't we? And hopefully we don't get jumped along the way. Okay, so far so good. Oh, we already... <laughs> Guess we've already gotten that before. I remember the last time I ran through this, actually, now. I didn't have any Scarlet Rot pills, so I just had to sit here and wait for my bar to go down. It's probably the most patient I've probably the most patient I've ever been in my entire life. Come on, pick up the thing. Oh, would you look at that? Okay, we here now. Oh wait, why'd I eat that? There's a friggin' grace right here. Silliness. Alright, well, you know what's up on those pillars though, Warcon? That I missed out on earlier? Because... I'm kind of curious what's up there now, since I can't get it. Hopefully it's nothing too game-breaking. The Grand Cloister. There's a somber 8 or 9. Oh, okay, well, never mind. I'm not missing out on much then. You can just go ahead and buy some of those. Would be nice to have some freebies, but... Not the biggest of deals. Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot, I, forgot I, I think I forgot to ask this, but uh, who were you fighting with uh, when you were helping out with your your furled finger activities? Or was it a, a boss I haven't encountered yet in the DLCs?
Look at all these long boys. Giving praise to something. about to sit here and play with you. Good job, me. I was fighting that super armored dude early in the DLC. Oh, I also helped kill Melania. Finished it off with raiding a fort in the DLC. Oh, so you were all over the place. My man's getting around. Well done. <laughs> well, that's not suspicious at all. Just a chest that lights up in the middle of a room. Not suspicious in the least. Scorpion Stinger, huh? Well, all right then. That's super armored, dude. People really needed help with that guy, huh? Jail Knight and his insane greatsword, yeah. Craziness. Well, I mean, okay. I mean, he did get me the first try, so I shouldn't really... Yeah, tons of people summoned there. Really? Well, I'm starting to feel better about myself then. Because, yeah... Damn. I don't mean to I don't mean to flex, but I killed him and I killed him in two tries, you know what I'm saying? Just uh you know, just god gamer activities over here. You know what I mean? you know what I mean? Just well, hey. <laughs> or maybe they were just unfortunate people that uh <laughs> you know, maybe they were just unfortunate people that had the wrong build, you know what I mean? Because yeah, it's like you were saying, they really buffed up flame and strength builds in this patch. Well, in this part of the game, so... Maybe they're going in there with their bleeds and their scarlet rots and their... Uh, what else? Their magic? You had the wrong build? When I swapped over, I was like, wow. Yeah, okay. Weapon choice matters a ton, too. This is why I'm experimenting now. Normally, I would be just... Normally, I would just be one type of person and then... Continue on from there, but now I'm experimenting with a bunch of other different types of... Strength builds. Tried the Scarlet Rot, tried the... Just regular hammer boy. Alright, let's get in the coffin. Don't stay in the Scarlet Rot too long, bro. I didn't use all those Scarlet Rot pills just for you to stay in there too long during a cutscene. Jail Knight doesn't tolerate bleed boys. He curb stomps the rivers of blood users. Mmm. Oh, off I go.
Well, I'm happy. I'm happy that Bleed Boys are getting stomped now. Because, yeah. Uh, I faced off with plenty of Bleed Boys. And every time I get... Well, every time I get stomped. Unless they screw up and let me get like a backstab where I get to trade with them. Helping people out sounds fun, though, but I'm afraid that I'll do bad, and then they'll just be like, What? Why did I summon this idiot? He doesn't know what he's doing. Part of me wanted to get uh, Xbox Live again so I could... Well, I mean Xbox Game Pass, I should say. Because then I could run around as... Run around as Tregoth and... Yeah, just be be a lore accurate Tregoth. All right. Well, let's see how well we can block against giant magical beams. Oh yeah. Talking about the Talking about perfumers and omen killers earlier. Once a famous perfumer, Rolo imbibed a physic to rid himself of emotion, thus enabling him to enact his nightmarish labor, hunting the omen. Yeesh! I can't remember where I picked up Rolo, but I don't think it was anywhere near an omen. Oh wait, no, never mind. I got him from defeating those two omens. The metaphors for Moog and Morgoth. I remember now when you were hitting up that tower. But anyway, enough reminiscing. Let's do this thing. Well, what a way to start. All right, give me a second. Well, we can kind of block it. <laughs> Definitely did better than I thought. You missed, scrub. You teleporting. Come here. Those explode, that explodes. Yeah, I remember. Grab, that's a grab, that's a grab. Dang, that hurts. Stop running from me, you coward. Oh, what's that? All right, I can block that too. Will you hold still, you dingus?
Whoa, what? Oh, damn. He's eating me. Well, that was cheap. I see. Woo! So close, though. Oh, come on. Remembrance of the natural born. Well, thank you, G. Thank, thank you, GLC. Thank you, DLC, for giving me the. Giving me this America blessing. <laughs> Get out of here, Astel, you weird cosmic alien creature, you. Indeed. I don't know what my guy's problem was. He didn't need to come he didn't need to come out blasting me, like come out blasting like that. There was no need. Oh wait. This is the wrong way. God damn it. There was no reason for my man to be so hostile. I didn't even do anything. I just come into his room and then he just starts beaming me. I find myself saying this for a lot of Souls bosses, actually. It's like, why are you attacking me? I'm just a Tarnished. Why do y'all hate Tarnished so much? What do we do? Oh, Ring of Oath. Damn it. So now that we've done that, if we come back to here, are there a bunch of, are the black knives here? No, they're not here yet. What's going on, EG? You're still alive. I like that. Along the dark path of Empyrean, 
from Rena's Rise, as she calls it. Now Lady Rani is in your hands. I pray that you serve her well. Okay then. Uh, how do we trigger all this? We gotta go up here? <laughs> Thanks, Rumsoft. Everybody hate everybody hates me. Nope. I thought we could talk to her up here again. You're gonna come down here and hear Blade screaming? Oh, you got to get the ring from her. Oh yeah, that's right. That's what the that's what the key is for for that chest in Renala's room. I remember now. Okay. Uh. Okay, I remember. Thank you. Thank you. Oakley, Oakley. But before we continue on. With this sad boy hours quest, typical from soft activities, typical Souls game activities, I'm gonna take a break real quick. I gotta use the bathroom. And I wanna be fully locked in when I when I start to cry. <laughs> Anyways, uh, let's take another seven to ten. Y'all be cool. Shit, I love it. 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 It's great. I love it. I love it. I love it. Love it. I love it. I love it. Love it. I 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 love it. Love it. I love it. I love it. Love it. I 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 love it. It's great. I love it. It's great. Love it. Love it. It's great. Love it. It's great. Love it. It's great. It's great, love it, love it, it's great, love it, it's great, cool.
Yeah, it is. Hands down, one of my favorite songs. If not my... Well, yeah, it is my favorite song. In the Killer Instinct soundtrack. Makes me want to play K.I. again, goddammit. Oh, a little too low. Raise up a little bit more. Yes, that was in my tomb. I don't know how White Guy and Mick Gordon somehow made one of my favorite First Nations tracks of all time, but you know what? It's fine. I'll take it. We have Ring. All right, so now is it sad boy hours or do I got to go down to the, yeah, okay. I think we got to go downstairs first. Whoops. Why are we always getting sad boy hours? Well, um, yeah, couldn't tell you. This is probably, this is a probably a question for the devs. <laughs> question for Miyazaki and them. Um, uh, well, I mean, I don't know, maybe we could go, well, we already did the bot quest line. It was sad, but it was, like, happy sad, brought happy tears. <laughs> Proposing to Ronnie. No, nah, I'm not proposing. I'm just... I'm curious. Because, like I said, I did her... I did her ending in the... In my first playthrough, but I completely forgot... What happened, because it's so long ago. And it's being the lore monster that I am... I would like to remember what the hell's going on. Well, I mean, I guess I am kind of proposing to her, huh? If I recall rightly, she... She made me her consort after this when I put the ring on it. First things first, let's go fight a dragon. I do remember the dragons here. Where are you at? You're gonna materialize out of nowhere, right? Yep, here we go. Come here. Three hits. No, that poor sheep, you monster. Woo! What? Where did that come from? My horse, you jerk. This is such a lucky rock. Ow. Damn.
Damn. Give me these legs. That's right. Get out of my face. Fire. A duelist moon blade. Sweeping slash followed by a cold blade projectile. Oh, okay. So, okay. When they first did, when Adula first did this, I didn't know there was a projectile afterwards. I thought the blade just had some wacky hitbox that just somehow caught me. I was about to go back and review the footage again on some... <laughs> on some instant replay. The moon blade used to be super busted. Dang, they nerfed it. Because that was another thing that I was looking to get into. I wanted to look into... Look into an ice build. You know what I'm saying? Use all the elements. It would triple proc frost if cast from the right hand for some reason, so boss's health would just plummet. Oh... Damn. Yeah, that sounds cheap. <laughs> well, I'm assuming they fixed that then, huh? Ice build is really good, just not with Light Greatsword from the DLC. I did that, and I'm suffering. Uh-oh. Uh <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. Your Rolana... Your Rolana builds. Yeah, that is unfortunate, my guy. What I was thinking of using, actually, I was thinking of using the... Uh, I was thinking of using Zamor stuff, or Zamor. Whatever his dang name was. You can have all this back. It was a curved sword, I believe. Yeah, this guy right here. It was this guy, and then... Where was his armor again? I think I got his armor. Yeah, here it is. I'm curious now. How would I, how would I look in this? Nobody look at me, I'm naked. Uh, 
That looks all right. The shackle on the left hand could probably go. But yeah, I like this sword. This is probably a dex build, though, yeah? Yeah, dex build. Cause frost build up. Oh, whoops. Zamora's Ice Storm. Plunge her curved sword into the ground, building power before unleashing a freezing storm that batters the surroundings. Let me put a... That dex on here. Let's give it a try. That's okay. That does not go as far as I would hope, though, unfortunately. But I am curious as how, how as to how good this would do against the giants, and I'm not really all that f I'm not all that familiar with the frost status ailment. But I think what it does is it just makes you more squishy. Or makes you brittle or something like that. Like once the status ailment is filled up to the maximum. You just take more damage. Anyway, dang, a lot of condensation on that bottle. Back to the... What did I have here? Oh yeah. Uh, goat talisman. Bull goat. Oh yeah, I don't need you either. Let's go back to you. Oh, I never got the Nox Swordstress armor before. And shield. Yeah, it has HB pop and then takes about 20% extra damage. Nice. Very nice indeed. Alright, let me drop off. I already got the Scorpion Stinger Dagger. I'm pretty sure I have Marius's Executioner Sword. Why'd I go from the bottom? That was silly. It's right here. Oh, it's next up. Yeah, there it is. Jeez, I'm blind. Okay, so we already have you. Put the Zaymor Curve Sword away. We already have you. Godskin Pike. Do we have you already? Spears are over here, right? Yeah. Peeler or whatever. Godskin Peeler. Did I pass it? Or did I not have it before? I swear I did. Oh, it's right here. Okay. So yeah, we got that. Great stars. We have you somewhere, right? Yep, right here. Pesclave. Yes, we do. Okay. So we got all these already. <laughs> yeah, so this is uh, Arcane Strength and Dex, huh? I don't think I've ever put any... Yeah, I have never put any sort of X I've never put any sort of skill points into Arcane in my entire in my entire life. <laughs> I've never done anything Arcane. Uh we already got this Briar Shield, right? Yeah, there it is. We 
got the briar shield. And I'm pretty sure... We have all these extra tarnish gear. Then have you. We definitely have Leandale Soldier's Gauntlets, Scaled Gauntlets, Albrechts. Albrecht's Bracers. Yeah. Yeah, we did. And we got all these already. The Istvan gear, Raging Wolf gear. Yeah, we can just keep that for now. Okay. Now that we're done inventory sorting. Let's get down here. And here we are. Ronnie, without her coat on. Full puppet mode. And her two fingers all messed up. What happened, my guy? Or girl. Whatever gender fingers could possibly be. She's just waiting. She's doing something. Damn, we put it on the ring finger, too? She's already got a ring on that hand, bro. At least take the first one off. Doubling up on the ring. Oh, well, see ya. Guess she said no. Oh, uh, hey, look who's here. You know, I just realized, that really was like a marriage proposal, wasn't it? I thought you were joking, talking about marriage. <laughs> but I really got down on one knee, put a ring on a ring finger. How did I not put that together when I was doing this the first time? I guess maybe I was too flabbergasted by the whole twisted and broken fingers over here. So it was thee who would become my lord. Perhaps I needn't have warned thee. I am pleased, however. Thou art a fitting choice. I go now to the night sky. It is there I shall find mine order. I bid thee. Travel the path of the Lord, and once all is done, we shall see each other once more. Well, all right then. Uh, good talk. Dark Moon Greatsword. We've already got this. Ooh, more frost buildup. Strength, Dex, and hella intelligence. Just... Yep, typical greatsword things.
<laughs> Need some more int. I don't think I have. I don't think I can, even with all my equipables. Yeah, no, we don't got this. Ah. Oh, well. Oh, yeah, that's right. Let's unequip this. Is this the way out? Yeah, it was. Okay. Um, uh... So, there were some towers here. Right? There. Well, I mean... Yeah. Oh, there was a jail here. I remember there was a puzzle here also. I just forget what it was. I think we had to... Did we have to hit some turtles? I think we had to hit turtles when we were up here. Had to hit some spirit turtles. Let's go cry, and then we'll go take it over to the DLC, I guess. Never mind. My guy is still chilling. How's it going? I helped uh, Ronnie do her stuff. I put a ring on it. Never mind. Y'all can just go a ha go on living then, I guess. Um Yeah. So we could also dung eater it up. We can... I don't know what else to do for the Millie storyline. I think she just meets us in... The, at the, I think she just meets us at the Halig tree. So we just gotta... Head on over. Oh yeah, that's right. Still had Volcano Manor things to do. That's right. I wanted to kill Rykard as well. Yeah, we can do that later. DLC. go to moon gazing grounds yeah what is it with these carrion folk and giant circles of water Skidoo, 23 Skidoo. Alright, what's going on, Letta? 
Hello again. Did you meet my compatriot? They're quite the congregation, from places as far and wide as you can imagine. Doubtless it have all come to blows at first glance. Were it not for the charm kindly Nicola put upon us, this is what allows us to serve together. The work of a living God. <sighs> Damn, why am I so curious about the horn scent? Wondering about the horn scent, are you? True enough? In any other circumstance, he'd be at our throats. Long ago, Queen Marika commanded Sir Mesmer to purge the tower folk. A cleansing. Oh, that explains that. No wonder the horn scent holds the earth in contempt. That aside, man is by nature a creature of conquest. And in this regard, the tower folk are no different. They were never saints. They just happen to be on the losing side of a war. But it's still a wretched shame. They were no saints, huh? Well... That's one way of looking at it. <laughs> she does seem to be speaking objectively here, but I... I would need to hear more about the war between Mesmer and the Horn Scent before I can fully commit to agreeing to that. Wondering about the horn scent, are you? True enough? Long ago, a cleansing. No wonder the horn. That aside, and in this regard, they were never saying they just happened to be on the... But it's still a... I can't, uh... Oh, now I can. Carved words coalesce. I abandon here my heart. Skidoo tree fragment, thank you. Monk's missive. May the best win. Oh, are we gonna get some fisticuff weapons now? Letter bearing a terse message and an illusion and an illustration of a monk, his hands held together. Seek me to the east if you wish to pursue the way of the warrior. When you find me, you will challenge me to a bout. There is no need for words. Oh, well, okay. <laughs> he wants to throw hands. We don't even know what horn sense society was like. Yeah, I'm saying. She's saying there were no saints. But like I said, she was speaking rather frankly like she knew what she was talking about, so... For a second there, I was convinced. I was just like, oh, okay, they were... They were also terrible people as well, but I don't know what they were doing. We see they're massive warriors with infinite poise. They're probably pretty strong for us. Yeah. I could hardly... I mean, yeah. I was rocking friggin' Tregoth gear and the ha and a fully pimped out hammer, and it still took me like four or five shots in order to stagger them up. It was quite ridiculous, and I could never, yeah, and I could never stagger them. Uh, well, I mean, I couldn't make them flinch. Just whenever they were swinging, they were just swinging, and there's nothing I can do except hold it or dodge. Yeah, the monk's missive is also hilarious. You imagine him just out in the woods and then some random, poor random sucker just happens to be coming through there at the time. And then he's just like, you, me, we must throw hands now. Yeah, the flame skewer, those dudes just don't care. They do not care. Nah, they don't. Like I said, I couldn't imagine how it was for you with rocking your faith int builds <laughs> all y'all rocking your bleed builds oh yeah man I have 12 hearts so yeah seek me in to seek me to the east
And the east is over here somewhere. Well, I guess we gotta put a marker on these. How's it going, Mr. Hornscent? You have a knack for timing, my fellow. I found the site of a new cross. Take this. Well, thank you, sir. Map of cross sites received. Check inventory. Nicola has said as much himself. He wishes now to throw it all away. He says the act, though undoubtedly painful, will sear clean Earth Three's wanton sin. The truth of his claim can be found at each cross, which is evidence enough to earn my belief. Go to the misshapen tree of Umbra. In that forsaken place, blood must spill. The blood of your fellows, the Earth Three faithful. I've had my fill. Indeed, I have no wish to wax nostalgic about days gone by, nor do I yearn to friendship kindle. <laughs> yeah, fair enough. Go to the misshapen in that forsaken. Trying to buy him off with of some terrible ass scorpion stew. You know, I really picked a good time to become a flame knight, huh? Because now I'm going to go... I'm, well, I mean, I don't have to go fight the big fire giant, but I mean, I have to go fight the big fire giant. Oh yeah, actually, real quick. I'm going to hit up Sir Moore over here. I'm going to sell him some stuff. Then we're going to put on... Then we're going to put on the Tregoth gear and then go smack around that giant a little bit. Welcome. How's it going, Sir Moore? How are we doing? I like finding things for you, Lady Leda, our allies. And the forage of things. Have you have you. I don't know. Whoop. Do I still have... I'm assuming I do. I'm pretty sure I have the Dark Moon Blade here, but... We're gonna double check just in case. Yeah, there it is. Oh, these are different. Okay. Oh, we got one of you already. And... Yeah, I think we're good for now. Oh, yeah. Tragoth gear. Let me get my hammer. Oh, yeah, that's right. Wait, maybe, um... Maybe Mr. Moog villain here can... would like to know about these new... sites of Mikola. Mikola. Righteous tarnished. Nope, never mind, he knows about it. 
I forget how many he said he knew about already. I think he said he knew about four of them? Six of them? Something like that. <clears throat> I really hope I'm not missing any, but at the same time... I probably am. Okay, let's... Oh, wait. No, I don't need the Tregoth. All I need to do... Is I could... Ashes of War this bad boy and make it... Holy or bloody or icy... The sea strength seems kind of seems kind of okay. So is this pretty much the same as coats armament then slash sending out a mist forward? Yeah, so this is pretty much just like flame strike except it's frosty. get out of my ear there we maybe we could just make it heavy and then use the and then use the ability afterwards Well, let's not think about it too hard. Let's just trade Goth. Oh, uh, we got that. We got that. Let's put this on. Whoops. Then use there. Okay. Off we go. Oh yeah, that's right. Am I... Oh, never mind. I'm still a medium... Oh. Interesting. You there. Dang it. Why are you walking sideways now, of all times? You. I challenge thee. Oh, that delay. Where are you going? Don't you run from me, big fella. Don't you run from me. <laughs> I forgot what it was like to be Tregoth. Please don't anybody shoot me or try to jump me while I'm getting this map piece, please. Skidoo Altus. Oh, I thought I heard boss music for a second, but I don't see my other bars, so we're good. 
Alright, now, how the heck do we get over here? Alright, so I'm assuming that the monk is over here somewhere. Uh, okay. We don't need to be Tragoth right now, it would seem. Oh yeah, does that? It doesn't refill. That'd be kind of busted if it did. What? Ember of Mesmer. Ew. I don't want embers of Mesmer. Are you monks over here? Nope. That's fine. Come here. Let me talk to you. Oh, there's more of you. Ow. Ooh, they hurt. But I hurt too. <laughs> so anyways, I just started swinging my way uphill. Oh, it is nighttime, okay. So if I was a monk, where would I be? What is that? Oh, that's a bear. Do they got room bears here? I hate that. I hate that idea. Oh, Highland attire? Ooh, big bear. All right, let's do this. You with the with the face, with the bear face. Damn. Okay, he's got stuff. He's got, uh, he's got, um, magic. No, he's got incants. All right, well, I definitely want my one million back.
Oh, that's right. So, what's you up to? We're using range attacks, are we? Ah, oh, I was trying to jump. I thought I could get a swing in first beforehand. Oh, you went so far. What was that hitbox? I can block that, I can just block that. Oh, I missed. Keep getting caught with that every time. Damn it again. Woo I got saved there. Son. Pelt of lava. Oh, is this the bear scream that you can get? Or the, the bear move? The bear something. I remember seeing a, um, a move with a gigantic bear head. Leather crown. Highland warriors. Piece together using leather. White favor represents their homeland settlement. Highland warriors are known to be hunters of bears. To them, there is no act more glorious than subjugating than the subjugation of a savage beast. Oh, okay. So yeah, this is the this is the Scotland gear that I saw during the Yeah. Freedom ask gear. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Okay. Uh, break time. I am... Yeah, I gotta use the bathroom. <laughs> and I think it's been about another hour or so. Hopefully it has. Don't want to be taking too early of breaks here. But, yeah. I do gotta use the bathroom, so... Uh, yeah. 7 to 10. Y'all be cool.
Poof, nice break. Oh, that's right. One of these days, I'm going to remember to bring the camera down with me. Anyways, I guess we'll, excuse me, head on back to looking for this monk. Return to monkey. Definitely gonna check this place out. It doesn't look like we're gonna be able to get to here. Oh wait, no. Yeah, it looks like this path goes underneath here into here, so we'll check that out too. Maybe uh, this as well. This little thingy here. Right then. Oh yeah, that's right. Let me take off. Uh, let me take off my freedom gear. <coughs> Excuse me. And peep this first. The pelt of Ralva the Great Red Bear, worn upon the head without modifications, enhances incantations of what is jokingly called Bear Communion. This untreated hide, one at the end of a bloody bout, is just the thing to make a wild bear out of a warrior. Okay. How's this look with the... Ooh, wait a minute. That doesn't look that bad. Hold up. Yeah, I don't know what it is about the knight's helmets, but they don't look... They don't look good to me. I don't like that, like, alien, like, really skinny neck, and then it turns into a round head at the top type of look like it does how does it like okay you see my face right you see my face it's now how does that all that how's that how does all that face fit into that comfortably like the top of my head is like <laughs> Probably, I'm probably going full Zordon in that thing. I'm just... Rangers! I need to find... Five teenagers with attitude. Why do you gotta find teenagers, Zordon? Don't worry about it. Why, why not find some grown-ass human beings with training? Why are you asking so many questions? Just let her brother live. Not the friggin... I was about to say scorpion. Not the lobsters. Looks like poisonous lobsters, too. I'm only saying that because it's got green on it. Uh, we probably can't make that without taking damage, actually. We could probably make this, though. Another one of those hammer knights. Where'd you all come from? Whoa! Shit! Alright, if you want to scrap, we can scrap. 
That hurts. Ooh, Black Knight Greaves. I hate fighting in this tall grass. Let me get the hell up out of here. There's another one? Yes, come over here. Come on, fight me. Oh, two of you. Smithing Stone 6. Whew! Well. At least these jerks are giving me refills on my goddamn Estus. Alright, let's check out this river over here. Oh, can I even get there? Oh, wait, no. We just go this way. I see noodle boys. Oh yeah, it didn't, uh, hold up. Didn't, uh, weren't there new emotes with those noodly boys? I think I saw Archon in here a couple, a couple streams ago with the noodle boys. Yeah. <laughs> anyway y'all couldn't see that but uh, maybe you'll see it in chat later on I spammed a couple of them so there's a boss here right I see America what do we got? I hear music. Do we do we fight the noodles? Oh, what the hell? I guess we do. Do we really need a summon for noodle boys though? Or or is it this thing? Oh, that's a deer. Is this where the monk is? Skidoo tree fragment. I think I need one more. Is that a... No. Alright, we're about to fight some type of new fauna. Some new type of plant. So what do you bring to the table, good sir? Never mind, they're the same as before. That was the wrong button. Ah, oh, you suck. Alright, one second, if we're gonna be like that. Let me get the flame pots out. You big stinker. Oh, never mind. Can't do that yet. There we go. Uh, red main pots. Giant flame pots. Volcano pots.
We are a Galmir Knight, after all. We might as well. So people can really summon a spirit here to fight a plant. so fast. Yeah, there has to be more to this, right? Is this where the monk is? Ooh, mini Erd tree. Times like this, I wish I had a ranged weapon. Uh, and there you are, coming out from behind the tree all dramatic-like. I assume you will be the first to challenge me. Would I be right to assume that? Throwing buffs on your allies, huh? That's gonna help you, especially since your allies are so keen to, <laughs> so keen to come to your assistance. Well, good talk. Now, as much as I would like to believe it's only two of you in here, I don't. So, y'all can hold one of these. Yep, come on over. Away from your brethren. Come on. What is it with you people and throwing things? Alright. We're spamming R3. Doesn't seem to be anybody else except for you. Here's hoping it stays that way. Best Blessed Bone Shard. Oh, that's just another skull. Allow me to reintroduce myself. My name is Ho. Heal from afar. Uh, so we can be healers now. Greatly heals HP for distant allies. The spell reaches. Fires a projectile towards distant allies that resort... Oh, okay. Yeah, y'all can be... We can be healers.
Oh, my bad. I keep forgetting to turn on my lantern. I feel like I need to adjust the brightness sometimes because when I watch the streams back, like when I'm, like when I'm in a cave and I'm shooting something, I see it because I'm in the friggin, you know, I can see it as clear as day on my TV, but when I'm in the, when I'm watching the stream back, Sometimes I'm like, where the, what the hell am I shooting at? And then, all of the sudden, I connect with a headshot. That's only happened once, though. And I'm not using a ranged weapon anymore, so y'all should probably have not that much trouble seeing. Seeing what I'm seeing. You might have some trouble seeing this, though, because I'm about to zoom in on this guy. So we're fighting a bird? A bunch of birds. Why do I get the feeling that... Oh, wait. I still have. Yeah. I'm talking about you wish you had a ranged weapon. Blau. Oh, you can't get me? That is such a shame. I said... Oh, you stopped? Why'd you stop? Why can't we aim down? Hit him in the tail. Come on, man. I want you to hop up. Alright, fine. You can make your way up here, right, little buddy? Little friend? Damn, son, are these guys weak to fire? That'd be nice. Oh yeah, we can still summon Torrent. Mmm. That looks... Yeah. Looks a little bit intimidating. No, doesn't it? Doesn't seem we can get down there through regular means, though. Another one of these fire giants. Looks like a bunch of them died here.
can't see much else. Is this big boy. Alright, so there's a bunch of birds. We don't have to fight the birds, but... We'll see if we can pull them one at a time. If we can, then sweet, we'll just take out the birds. If not... Okay. There we go, come on up. Wait, what? That bird poisoned the hell out of me. Hold up. Okay. Well, gotta be ready for poison bird claws then. Can't always be blocking. Or... Yeah, we only got two of these, two of these left. Uh-oh. Four now. Man. Now I gotta hunt dragonflies? I have no idea where to hunt these dragonflies. I guess we just gotta be ruthless as hell and just gatekeep them on their way upstairs. Dang, that missed. Dang, that missed too. Keeping it simple. Uh, what else we got going on around here? I see plenty of birds, once again. Dang it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Whoa. Well, we got long boys here too. Is that what I see? Long boys off in the distance? I really hope I didn't just shoot an NPC. Judging by... Judging by the reaction. It looks like a long boy, though. Um, okay. I wonder if the... Cele I wonder if the... What was it called? Cerulean Tears? Celestial Dew. I really hope Celestial Dew works out in this... in this place. Otherwise, I just screwed up that interaction. Don't target this one. Really? You're not going to come over here? Oh. 
Okay. How about you, Bob? You gonna come over here? I won't even shoot you. Come here. Very good. We can stun lock him into hell. You up top, though. Yeah, I knew I could target you. Oh, they both got pulled shit. It's like I'm playing. <laughs> I feel like I'm playing uh, Lord of the Rings. <laughs> Y'all remember that, uh, you remember that Lord of the Rings Two Towers video game? The Battle for Helm's Deep, <laughs> where you're just running around, killing people and knocking them off ladders, killing, killing Urukai and knocking Urukai off ladders. And that's why you get the high ground, Anakin. Oh? A bird there. Whoops. Nope, wrong button. Come on over, come on over, baby. Or, you know, freak out first. Yeah. So there's nothing here except just birds and shrooms. What did I even get from that? Grave bird anklets. Oh. So we can get, run around getting grave bird gear. I got the chest piece already, so now we got the legs. Stone anklets, oh stone anklets, with a tinge of green. One of the set, one of the set of armor pieces cast into the, cast in the image of the grave bird. Sorry for my terrible reading. Grave birds are ancient golems created to guard the spring Spirit graves, built where all manner of death ultimately drift. So they're guarding death runes or something? Or people that support the death? Or they're guarding it because it is death and... I'm not sure. Damn it. Uh, he barely. He touched me once, and we get death. We get death. Not death. We get poisoned. Sorry, death was on my mind from the reading of the lore. Come on down. Ow.
All right, looks like the talons are the only poisonous thing here. Don't gotta worry about the beak. Oh, he was, he sees me. No, thank you. Oh, all right, down you go. You gonna come up or? Do I gotta come down? Oh, is he gonna figure it out? You're almost there. Gotta take your time in a place like this. Oh yeah, the long boy. Oh my god, we could talk to him. I'm so sorry, Mr. Longboy. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Uh... Damn. I done goofed, y'all. I done goofed. All right, maybe, uh, if I remember, I'll try to come back later and, oh, come on, more birds. I'll try to come back later and have a full-blown, grown-up conversation with them rather than just shooting them from a distance. That's right, bub. Come on. Come on over and come hang out. I kind of got to use the bed. Well, I mean, I got to use the bathroom again. What? Of course, he decides to turn at that exact moment. Oh, of course. You know what? Too high. There we go. Playing it slow. Okay. Ah. Yeah, sorry. Maybe it's all the... Maybe it's all the liquids I've been drinking. Well, I mean, what else would it possibly be? But I still gotta... Yeah. Uh, I'll be back, though. It's no BRV screen, just gonna take a minute.
looking to unpause the thing, but I just have to hit this button on the microphone. What's up, Archon? We back with donuts? Get this, guess the chair's gonna get him now. Oh no, I'm back. Let me get, actually, you know what? Hold on a second. <laughs> Oh, cho chocolate with sprinkles? Never mind. I just got the Boston cream. Boston cream's lit too? Yeah. I will not complain. I mean, I do, I am in Canada, so I am, I'm out here all the time with the Tim Hortons, I don't know if you got it on the, on the East Coast where you're at, I don't know if y'all have like, Dunkin' or something, some other donut chain. Pew! You gonna jump up here? Get out. <laughs> Wee. Y'all yeah, got Dunkin' and Starbucks. Mostly people buy from the grocery store. Oh, okay. What kind of stories are we talking about here? Because, for me anyway, oh, whoops, I did reload. The type of grocery stores I got out here is like Thrifties, Save On Foods, Costco. Local US change. The at the atmosphere in this game is crazy good. I don't I don't like this place. I don't like it at all. But I guess it was supposed to be designed that way, so I guess they did do a good job, huh? You're in a rural area. Rural, 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 rural area. Doesn't have enough interest for an Aldis or anything fancy. I have no idea what an Aldis is. I've not heard of this. The only Aldis I know is Nick Aldis from WWE. I mean, I assume it just has. That place has all the fixins, all the assortment of food preparations and stuff. Food preparations. It has all the food. <laughs> Fancy East Coast grocery store. Okay, okay. Is there gonna be a boss here? We're gonna fight a monk? What is that? Oh, toxic mossling. What is all this?
uh, I guess maybe we could possibly try and get down there and get that, uh, yeah, because this seems like it's in an area that is very, that is low to the, that's lower on the ground, a lower level, so... That's where we are. We're on a low level. Now I'm just waiting to see what kind of things are going to come out and try to get me. Aw, oh, y'all have golems here too? Come on, man. Whee! You surprised I went down here? I'm surprised too. I'm just keeping... I'm just going. <laughs> I'm just going. Don't shoot me! You suck. Alright. You're gonna pay for that. No. Don't get stuck. Where is he falling? Glad I took care of him fast. Ooh, golden gold arrow. I mean, golden great arrows. This'll hurt. Uh, is there any more golems here, or...? Damn, you know what? I was gonna say, I'm, damn, he could reach up here, but I really shouldn't be surprised. throw. Oh, shit. Ow. I'm so glad I can block things. Will you stagger already? There we go. Oh my god, they're so beefy. Oh, you're still alive! Why? Why are we still living? This boy is destroying the hell out of the local wildlife.
All right, I th <laughs> we're close. We are close to the map. That's all I want. I want the map and then I'm gonna leave. Jesus. <laughs> Big into land documentation. That cartography. Oh, yeah. There is a church up there, isn't there? Yeah, so <laughs> I started heading... I started heading over here because I wanted to, well, I wanted to find the monk, right? I wanted to throw hands with the boy, but then somehow I ended up, I ended up in this cave and then, yeah, we just ended up all the way over here. <laughs> we're going to get to, we're going to get to monk eventually. Is that another dragon? Oh, headless, headless giant, huh? You haven't found Mr. Catch These Hands? He said somewhere to the east, so I just started heading east and praying. I mean, I'm assuming he's probably here, maybe? Or, I mean, have you explored up in here, I'm imagining? Probably. Likely. Yep, don't speak. No words are needed in a duel. In the words of Nago Ryuki from Guilty Gear Strive. I fought you already, bro. Your old news. You're sorry. Oh. Another piece of Miquela. Who this? Skudoo. I abandon here the flesh of my body. Why are you leaving pieces of yourself here, bro? That's so weird. Anyway, so, what, who's you? I see. You haven't seen this guy? Does he does does this look like a monk to you perhaps? Uh not really. He looks like a just he just looks like a traveler. You like my hair? Guess not. I wonder what he's contemplating. Big hat makes him look like a traveling missionary. Hmm. He also does have... He also does have that pendant. So... Leads me to believe... Dang, is he blind? What's up with his eyes? We need to get his attention. Hey! No. Hmm. Well, all right. 
right then. Maybe we'll find a reason to talk about something from in here. Stoning. They're trying to stone me. Oh wait, is there a grace right here? How did I miss this grace? Ran right past it. Still don't feel chatty? No. Maybe it's gonna be like a gold mask situation. I need to get some kind of item or seal in order to get him to acknowledge me. Acknowledge me! So, what are we praying to? Okay, okay, I get it. I hate dogs so much. absolutely destroying the locals. I'm sorry, locals. Don't you run from me. I see you. You get so many refills in your flask. I guess it's, al it's almost as if they expect you to get your ass kicked. To take some hits. So, what's going on in here? What's all this? Shattered stone talisman. Potency of kicking and stomping skills. Lichpin stones are spiritual anchors said to hold the ground in place and quell the fury of earthquakes. When this one shattered, the surrounding town fell into the broken earth? One account claims that the moon itself had come crumbling down. These lynch- these tiny things? Well. I don't think I can make this jump. Maybe? Nah. That's really far down. Oh, Jesus.
That's such a crazy shot. <laughs> Oh, there's an enemy down there, so you can get down there. Just, how the hell? That looks like a ledge just to my, just to my right here, where my sword, where the tip of my sword is at. Or it could just be an illusion. Well, I don't think I can get to it, actually. The ledge I'm on right now looks like it doesn't give me enough room to make that drop. So... Oh, hold the hell- hold on. Hold on. Let me- let me just... Dry Leaf Dane. Hold the hell on. I have like a million souls. <laughs> let me just let me just take my ass back here real quick and before I just go dropping down into random tunnels. We are all utterly captivated by kindly Nicola. It is what binds us together. Oh, he he was the monk. I think he was the monk. Oh, that man is known as Dane. He's been in the service of Nicola the Kind longer than I. He might be solemn of cheer, but is a fierce warrior nevertheless. There's no cause for concern. Dane's reluctance to speak to you is no fault of your own. We've been acquainted for quite some time, but even I am yet to hear his voice. Perhaps one day. So do I just do we do we throw hands? Do we throw hands now? I think we throw hands now. Okay, let's throw hands. Uh hopefully that's the right monk. Guess just punch him. I'm not punching him. I got no. <laughs> oh, what is what does his letter say? Where's this damn letter? The plateau occupied by Mesmer's army that peers towards the Skidoo tree to the northeast. Named after its counterpart in the realm of the Erd tree, as its center lies the Shadow Keep. Where's his, where, where? Where's his note? Rogier's letter. Oh, monk missive. Yeah, yeah, his, his outfit does look like his. He just had the hat on, that threw me off. Okay, seek me to the east if you wish to pursue the way of the warrior. Pursue. Pursue the way of the warrior. When you find me, you will not challenge... You will challenge me to a bout. You will challenge me to a bout. There are no need for words. Alright, I guess we just go swing on him then. Um, here's hoping we don't kill him, I guess. Or here's hoping he doesn't kill me. Damn, bro. Uh. Yeah. All right, it's on. It's on.
Hello, sir. Um... I've been led to believe that I just attack you. Did I do it wrong? Okay. Um, let's try the hands then. Man's just mocking me at this point. Let's just head more eastward. Maybe, uh... Maybe he's over here somewhere. Keep an eye out for the monk. You don't like this guy? You suck. That's a grab, that's right. Ah, those damn knives. I don't like those guys. I don't like those guys at all. <laughs> uh. Curse Blade Mask. The horn scent are really weird because they seem like they have like a Chinese influence, but they like talk like Scottish people. Really throws me for a loop. Just a complete, a complete mixture of people. Uh... Whoa! Okay, jackass. Come here.
Aesthetic ankle guards. I swear, man. I hate the, I hate all these movement these movement based enemies. I think I'm blocking and then all of a sudden they're just their hitboxes are behind me and I'm not blocking anymore. Well, look who's here. Alright, is there some type of emote that I could use, maybe? Yeah, they just decide you're taking damage. I mean, I guess they... I mean, you gotta create some type of way to make blocking not OP. Beckon, Bravo, Strength. Oh, he gave us a... Yeah, he gave us a emote. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just like you said. The May the Best Win emote. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, f to I totally forgot about that. Let's try that again. Maybe you didn't notice me. All right, here we go. Let's see what you got. What you got for me, Dane? That was probably deadly. Oh, the one inch punch. What? Man just went right through my shit. Oh, that reaches so far. Hold up. Oh, it comes back. What the hell?
Uh, did I just kill him? I really hope I didn't just kill him. <laughs> Otherwise, I want to know Kung Fu, my guy. I really hope this is a note that uh, leads me to his next location or something. Dry Leaf Arts, Dane's Hat. Grow not complacent. Continue to temper your strength. Okay. Um. Okay. I guess I. I guess I know Kung Fu now. So, Letta, uh... So, Letta, me and Dane threw hands, I beat him, and he left me a message. We are all utterly clear of what fun. Oh, that man, he's been in the service. He might be solemn of cheer. There's no call. Dane's reluctant. We've been acquainted. Perhaps one day. Well, okay. I got his hat now, and his fists. <clears throat> a technique for hand-to-hand -hand combat without the aid of a weapon. This martial art combines fist strikes and kicks. The teaching of the teachings of a group of spiritual seekers known as the Dry Leaf Sect, revealed only to those of worthy valor and character. The practice of this martial art marks down marks the dawn of the ascetic ascetic. Ascetic's journey. Palm blast. <laughs> Palm blast. Skill of the spiritual seekers known as dry leaf sec. Imbues hand with energy before using a palm strike to unleash an explosive blast. The already formidable power and impact can be bolstered by charging the attack. Oh, okay. So that's what he was doing. He was charging up that big palm strike and then I was catching it. Okay. And let's take a look at the hat, though. The sun faded and lightly soiled the hat of Dryleaf Dane. Worn low over his eyes, it obscures the wearer's vision. Meeting the gaze of another can overcome the senses, often leading to the downfall of those who would walk the noble and solitary seeker's path. Damn, this man is the ultimate introvert. Doesn't even want to make eye contact with you, so he gets a big hat to... Gets himself a, ri a Raiden hat. That's kind of sick. Maybe I should get a hat with a gigantic brim on some Kung Lao... On some Kung Lao-ish. So what else would I... One, two, three, four, five, six. Two. Wacky. Yeah. This looks kind of weird with my, uh, I need to find some better. <laughs> Shaolin shadow boxing and the Wu-Tang sword style. If what you say is true, the Shaolin and the Wu-Tang could be dangerous. 
Do you think your Wu-Tang sword can defeat me? I mean, he was, he was right, though. The Wu-Tang is very dangerous, not to be fucked with. Well, I mean, we gotta throw hands now, right? I mean, obviously. So, this is probably a dex weapon, though, right? All right, let's take a let's head on back. I'd be playing fighting games out here, so the idea of throwing hands with a I think you might have to Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, I, we can infuse, I guess, right? Oh, we can, thank God. <laughs> put cold on it, put blood on it. Poison, flame art, fire. Magic, quality... Put damn near anything you want to on it. That way it's not just default scaling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Imagine your hands are so dirty you poison somebody. Yeah, you poison them. Okay. I don't know, for some reason I thought this would be one of those uh, unique weapons where you have to use Somberstone in order to upgrade them. Lucky for me, not the case. Unlucky for me, I am now very broke. Because I spent all that... Because I spent all that money upgrading. Whoops. All right, here's open. I thought Fire Knight Greatsword would be a somber weapon. I was happy it was a normal weapon. I was like, stamp uppercut. <laughs> Damn it. I thought I was going to get some epic move, and all you give me is a stamp uppercut? Regular ass move. Back already, no matter. And now we mash. Alright, never mind. I was rich enough. It's amazing what 100,000 runes can buy for you. 20,000 to spare. Oh yeah, let me see if I can get the that Astol. Bastard stars. Bastard stars? Wave of darkness. Oh, this is an ash of war. Great hammers, great axes, great spears, and colossal weapons. Oh, wait a minute. This... Okay, well, first things first. Let's take a look at this. This is a flail. Flail which deals magic damage, having been imbued with power by the remembrance of Astol. Formed of 
the same many colored stars debris many colored star debris that comprised the form of the natural born of the void imbue the natural born stars with magic to perform a sweeping strike this attack leaves a dark cloud of stars and in its wake that lingers briefly before oh yeah 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 that hole that big swipe he leaves a trail of purple kush behind and yeah it explodes afterwards i remember now i'm tempted to take this since it can be used by gigantic weapons uh, we got the brian got the brian gear now I was very surprised that Brian was a was a was worthy of remembrance equipment of champions gear. Anyway, Alright, what kind of... What kind of gear do you think it'd be? Would be the way to go. Actually, I think the hat may be... Oh, wait. Hmm. Maybe the... The starter gear for the... For the dexterity boy? That could be a thing. Oh, the skeletal mask? Raven Mount boys? Maybe we can go back to the duelist things? Champion gear. Could also be a thing. Badlands gear. Maybe Godfrey gear, perhaps? Blood Knight. This is all getting a little too heavy for my liking. Yeah, no, I don't think any of this would be good. Yeah, maybe we could bring the Gladiator back. Uh... Wear gold mask gear. Sanguine Noble, we're Moog stuff. <laughs> I always liked uh, Moog's uh, flavor text on his gear. It was just like, you know, the reigning lord and hierarch of the coming dynasty of Mogwin. Or maybe he was just batshit insane. <laughs> A raving lunatic. You know, it could be either or, take your pick. Was the oh yeah 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 that's right no never mind we don't get the 
the duelist gear does not have arm pieces. So what did I get? I got the... Oh. That's right. Raptor Black Feathers. Okay. I think I went too far. Huh. I guess I don't have the full Raptor gear then. can bring out the bandit stuff too. I don't think it'll probably look the greatest, but you never know. You can have these back. You gotta go well thank you for chilling archon i'm just yeah i'm probably gonna wrap it up soon to be honest i'm about to i was just very interested in these hands so i'm gonna be just testing this out real quick looking at outfits and winding it down from here so yeah thank you for joining and yeah have a good night have a good night Let's let's sit over here. Test our hands out on some unsuspecting chumps. This doesn't look all that bad. Oh yeah, maybe we should, uh, so we can block with that. And then just throw a huge bright haymaker. I wonder what happens when we equip it to this hand. Oh, we just switched and become lefty. Interesting. Then it just becomes regular fist weapon. But when we right hand it, all of a sudden we get Kung Fu.
Interesting. Oh yeah, that's right. I wanted to... Oh yeah, we still want you. Uh... You... Where was that talent? This one. Raises attack power with lower equipment load. And there was also one that was like... Raises... Raises resistance, not raises resistance, just. What was it? Enhances final hit. Um, I think there was some kind of talisman that helped you deal more damage with the more strings that you do, or something like that, with your more attacks that you do. Increases damage. Kicking and stomping skills. Yeah, here we go. Raises attack power with successive attacks. This is what we probably want right here. Successive attacks restore HP. Blood loss. In the vicinity increases attack power. Raises attack power after each critical hit. Restores HP upon defeating an enemy. Raise attack power after defeating an enemy. Raise attack power when summoned spirit dies. Item discovery. Eliminates all sound. Conceal wear while crouching. Nah. That's fine. Uh, this fit doesn't seem all that terrible, but let's continue on. I don't know, maybe if I wasn't so thick, I would be inclined to use this. Oh, yeah, that's right. You know what I should have done? I should have headed over to Bach. That way he can change my gear for me. For free. Bockington, how are we now? Bock the seamster, ready to make a job. Going already and pleased. Alright, here we go. You there with the face. They added kung fu to this game. This might be the fit, to be honest. I like it. We could bring the hoodie back, though. I do like the hoodie. 
Just being out here bare chested is kind of weird. <laughs> So that's what you do. Uh, I like the luck, but it doesn't really seem to go all together that well with the Kung Fu. At least I can't see it. Out of all the gear, this seems to make the most sense. Oh, there's an earth tree over here. Oh yeah, that's right, and um... Hmm. Real quick, I'm going to look up... <clears throat> I'm gonna look up real quick on how... to... Progress the gold mass storyline. Wait, I'm already in the wiki. I should have just. Oh, whatever, we're fine. <laughs> Killing this NPC does not make you a sinner. <laughs> Let me get out of this damn chat, though. Altus Plasto, part of Baldwin. <laughs> MBC has no other dialogue than dot dot dot. Gives mending rune perfect order. Okay, so maybe he's relocated to the Coliseum. That's right, maybe what we needed to do is... Maybe we gotta bring... Oh, wait, he's gone. Well, damn. Um... I think this is the closest way in order to get up to the Colosseum. Let's see. Yep. Ow. Oh. 
Nope. That is the wrong way. Okay. Uh, that buff doesn't last too long, though. Hello, my fellow dude. <laughs> Just a big uppercut to the nuts. I wonder if the backstab gets me anything else. Nope. On wake up. Ritual Shield Talisman. One, two. One, two. One, one, two. It doesn't look like he's here. Okay, maybe he's back at the bridge. Let's have a look. Oh yeah, I wonder how... <laughs> Let's go around punching things. Kind of like some Yamazaki hitboxes right there, like a stendo arm. Looks like he's still there. His brother Corrin here, though. Nope. Just a couple of half naked dudes chilling. I hate to tell you guys, but this is what peak male performance looks like. This is what peak male performance looks like. You versus the guy she tells you not to worry about. Alright, I need to take all my anger on something after that, so let's just punch this guy. Be very... Uh, very quiet. We are sneaking up on battle mages. Right in the ass.
All right, battle mage gear. The noble gold mask. So, what gives them? What causes him to move to the... What did it say again? It says, Brother Corn can be found in the main round table hold. After leaving the round table hold, he can be found north of Altus Highway Junction side of Grace. North of Altus Highway Junction, Site of Grace. All right, then we tell him about Gold Mass location. Okay, okay, okay. We back. We back. All right, we'll go around punching things, and then we'll. find him over here. Ow. Ow. How dare. Was he up here? I feel like he was up here. No, 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 wait. He was along the road here. He was by a... Yeah, there he is. No, that's not him, Jamie. See ya. I feel like I encountered him back here somewhere. Or maybe he's over here? Yeah, so there's some soldiers chopping it up. How's it going, fellas? Damn, one punch man. Is he up here with the finger crone? I could also... Nope. Lump of flesh. Lovely. Damn, I really didn't hit up this side of Grace. Altus Highway Junction. Altus Highway Junction. This is bring up the map. What am I playing around here for? After your information... Map link. Be around here. Man, why do I gotta connect to that chat every time? I always see the wildest shit being typed in there. Well, not always, but sometimes. I'm just glad y'all haven't seen it when I'm on stream. Yeah, we just straight up passed him. Alright, let's try that again. Oh yeah. I bet. Keep forgetting to... Oh, we back? Sorry, the phone is... Uh... 
You have to catch up. Yeah, there we go. Where are you at, Mr. Corrin? Ow. Light me on fire, bro. Yeah. What? Man, what is that fire hitbox? So, what the hell? Is he not here? I, I guess he's not here. Because that... Unless he's up top? Could he be up top? Nobody say anything. Ah, oh, look who we have here. How delightful to meet a familiar face, even after departing the round table hold. I've been doing some learning of my own since then, actually, and will happily pass it along to you. Do, do you sport with me? Do you sport with me? I do not sport. It can be no other than the gold mask himself. Of course, of course, I knew he would be close by. Bless the golden order and its benevolent rays. And to you too, my sincerest thanks. May the golden order shine through you. Look, look, okay. You see how he's dressed? He blends in with the background really well, okay? The way the map was set up, it made, it made it look like he was on this side of the road. I will soon leave to join the note. It is entirely thanks to you. May the golden... Alright. Then... Let's see if he joins them. Whoa, 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 Torrent, whoa. Nothing to see here. Ah, there they go. Having a good old time together, are we? How's it going, friendo? Ah, we meet yet again. Thanks to you, I have become acquainted with the noble gold mask himself and taken my place by his side, as you can see. Have no fear. I will still teach you incantations as before, though we must do so quietly, such that we not disturb the great master's cogitation. The master is always deep in contemplation, while I frantically attempt to record his wisdom, the movement of his finger, and though I am yet to comprehend even the daintiest morsel of his wisdom, I know that this, this, is my life's calling. The Golden Order has bestowed me, talentless as I am, the great duty of documentarian. <laughs> oh, man. May the Golden Order. You know what, man? Good, good luck to you.
this man must have the most... Like, imagine holding, like, just holding your arm like this. How long do you think you can hold your arm up? I would die in, like, five minutes. If I, if that. Probably not even make it that long. This man's just been standing here all day, just... Some serious stamina on this man. Or... Tarnished. Whatever this dude is. You know what? Let's give it a try. I'm gonna try to fight my way up these stairs and then we're gonna call it after that, just because. Just to test this out. Oh, wait a minute, there's a falling star beast. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. There's a, I think there's a falling star beast up this side. Yeah, there's like a meteor that struck here. Okay. Excuse me, fellas. Ow. My horse, you sucker. He's up here, right? There we go. Still hit me. I was just about to palm his ass.
that stupid rock. Damn, that's a lot of gear. Smithing stone five, smithing stone six, gravity stone fan, fan, chunk, chunk. Okay. Well, we got there eventually. What? Ow, that delay. Bro, when I tell you that th I thought this was the cheapest shit, two? Two? You're gonna have two of these boys here? Whoa. See my man teleported? What the hell? Where's the other one? Oh. Hey, 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 you.
Ah, oh, the delay. Too. Ugh. My friggin' nose, man. Itchy the whole time. Hero's rune, great shield, cool. Yeah, I just need to learn how to dodge again. I'm getting, I gotten way too used to, got way too used to the blocking. I could probably still block, but... It's probably not in my best interest to block with my hands. I'm just lucky that other tree sentinel just decided to go downstairs. Otherwise, that would have taken so much longer. And I'm also glad I had those those Gelmir pots on me. I think you can summon Millicent here to help you fight the... Wait. No. There's either a gargoyle here, or there's a dragon here. I think it's just a gargoyle. One second. Let's bring up Millie's quest line real quick. Or Millie's location. This has nothing to do with her quest. Oh look, I spelled Millicent right, I, I think. Locations, Godskin Apostles, these moves can be fought. Let's connect. Defeated, summon boss fights. Oh, Draconic Tree Sentinel, capital outskirts. In Draconic Tree Sentinel in Capital Outskirts. Oh no, okay, it must be it must be here for because they're talking about a tree spirit, right? So that's okay. You know what? I'm getting I'm getting sucked into the gameplay again. I'm having too much fun throwing hands. So Oh wait, why am I? Let's quit while we're ahead. Anyways, thank you all very much for joining me. Thank you, Archon, for chilling, and anybody else that may have been lurking in the meantime, in between time, I wish you all a good day, or else, you know the drill.